welcome to the MBS Show, episode 94. I am your host, Norman Sanzo. And I'm the only one here. I gave everybody a day off. And well, this is not going to be a long episode. So let's get to it. In housekeeping, well, nothing much happened. I went to Comic Fiesta this past weekend and it was wonderful. I met a lot of bronies and I met a lot of new friends. And soon in the future, I might bring in some brony artists that I met at Comic Fiesta and, you know, talk about their stuff and their work. That's about it for housekeeping. And let's move on to news time. In today's news time, Star Soul Academy might change its name. Recently, the fan-made visual novel game Star Soul Academy received a letter from Hasbro. In the letter, Hasbro had asked them to change the character's name to prevent any confusion with their properties. It might look bad, but according to the game's creator, while it may seem like this limits us to what we can do, it's actually very freeing. We don't want to step on Hasbro's toe. In that sense, it opens many more doors than it closes. Will it be weird getting used to different characters? Probably, but you won't be able to spot the story difference if you didn't know what it was like before. So please don't freak out and please don't jump at Hasbro. They're very reasonable and we're not suffering any setbacks. Links can be found in the show notes. Well, this news might not come as a surprise, but it was pretty cool on Hasbro to tell them, well, to nicely tell them to change the name of the characters and stuff. And you know what? This opened up more opportunity in storytelling and character development. You're not lock into one set of characteristics that's already been developed. You can expand the story or expand the characters. And it's going to be cool. Uh, I can't wait for the full game to be released. And moving on to the next one, Pony Plushies available in Japan. The My Little Pony official EC shop in Japan started selling Pony Plushies. The plush comes in two sizes, a small and a medium. The small plush is... 6.5 6.5 cm in width, 17 cm in height, and 12 cm in diameter, and will cost 1,680 yen. And as for the medium plush, it's going to be at 8.5 cm in width, 27.5 cm in height, and 17 cm in diameter, and it will cost 2,625 yen. Currently, all plushies are sold out and it is unknown when they will restock it. Links can be found in the show notes. And wow, this is an interesting development. I thought they cancel out the plushie orders or the plushie development. But you know what? This opens up a new avenue for us fans to get more choices in plushies. Recently, I got the 4DE Twilight plushie and it is awesome. And you know what? The Japanese plushie looks pretty good. If you have any friends in Japan that are willing to buy them for you, you could, you know, ask them nicely to buy one for you, something like that. Maybe do an exchange or pay them maybe. And moving on to the next topic, well, there's no guests, so obviously there won't be any guest time. And shout outs. Well, and all of my shout out goes to my roommates that shared a hotel room with me. It was also meeting you guys, and thanks for the D&D game. It was my first time, and it was crazy. You know who you are. Thanks a lot, man. And to all the brony artists that I met there, you guys are awesome. I'll do a proper introduction and proper thing with you guys soon enough. Maybe next year. Next year is just a few weeks away, depending on when you listen to this episode. And to all of the Malaysian bronies that I met at Comic Fiesta, Thank you for sharing that awesome experience with me. And especially to that one Rainbow Dash cosplayer. You were awesome. Seriously, you were awesome. So if you have any questions, concerns, or suggestions for the show, you can contact us at mbsshow at gmail.com. And if you would like to email us personally, you can reach me at norman at mbsshow.com. And if you would like to reach Daniel, you can reach him at daniel at mbsshow.com. And Charlie is charlie at mbsshow.com. You can also reach us on Twitter. The show's Twitter account is at the MBS show. Sweetie bot, you know what? 
I should promote SweetieBot to SweetieMod. <laughs> SweetieMod will interact with you, talk with you, and, well, post stuff about things that I don't know. <laughs> and also, you can follow me at Norman Sanzo. I'll tweet about food, toys, and whatever tickles my fancy. And, well, follow me if you want to look at some pictures of Comic Fiesta and cosplayers. It's going to be interesting. And also please subscribe and rate us on iTunes and Stitcher Radio and also like our Facebook page. Links will be provided in show notes. And I have been Omar Sando and here's wishing you all a happy heartwarming to everyone and all. I'll see you guys next episode. Bye!